Hey, what's up, guys? Today is uh, July 10, 2014, and uh, as you may know, today is the day. Today is finally the day. Finally, today is the day. Today is the day that I personally thought that I would get my LG G2 even before I got a shipping notification. I knew that T-Mobile was going to ship it out because they saw that AT&T started shipping out their phones right after their uh, pre-orders went up. People got overnight right away. I think it really sucks that uh, it had to go down the way that I bothered a lot of customer service reps. I uh, emailed T-Mobile. I bothered some more reps. what I had to get when I wanted to get it and I'm glad it's coming today been very anxious in doing this so I'm just waiting on the UPS came from work went to sleep and hoped that my package was gonna be there by the time I woke up apparently that didn't work the package is still out for delivery and I'm hoping it comes really soon instead of the end of the day so I can enjoy and see. I'm currently on my way to uh, go get my Starbucks. It's pretty hot out here, it's like 82 degrees. Really nice. I also got my uh, tool that I needed for my RC. I got my uh, piston stopper and I got the... You know what happened? I was quite surprised what happened when I received my packages. I looked in the bag and I know I had ordered a piston stopper, okay, you know. That came from uh, DDM. They've discount order. They got good prices, you know. And the next package was supposed to be a clutch shoe spring. You know, the 8,000 RPM spring only. I opened it up. It came from a hobby store that I never shopped from. I just went on eBay and bought the spring. It was for seven bucks, you know. I go ahead and open the package. Seems are a bit heavy for uh, what it's supposed to be. And uh, I check it out and apparently they didn't send me the spring. They sent me the complete shoe spring clutch shoe set. So I was like, huh. I'm like, I'm pretty sure when I order it the first time, it said they could not charge my card. So I went ahead and checked my bank and clearly I was right. The people that were supposed to send me the clutch spring only, they only charged me for the clutch spring, but they went ahead and did me a good favor and sent me the whole spring clutch shoe set. So I'm really happy because I got something for the price of something else, you know? So I'm really happy about that. Uh, I'll be working on my low C really soon, getting that uh, clutch shoe set ready and uh, making it happen because I haven't drove that since I left on vacation. I drove it for like 30 minutes after, before we went uh, on vacation. It was dirty, it was stuck, it had spiders in it because I didn't clean it before pan. So um, that'll be my job for today after I get my phone. Other than that, play with my phone, set it up, review it, give you guys a glimpse of my anxious, impatience life waiting for the UPS truck who knows maybe I put the head strap on so that way you guys could do uh, you guys could see first person view of a person with OCD over a new phone that hasn't been released and is not scheduled to be released in store until the 16th of July and we're getting it on the 10th 
many people have been asking why we're getting it and some people are not I, I really have no idea I went ahead and complained I went ahead and asked and you know they made it happen I guess all those times of me asking them you know when is my uh, phone gonna come when is it gonna be released when is it gonna be charged what's going on what can I see my order you know they went ahead and told me that yeah you've been with us for so many years and we gotta make sure you get your phone on time on release date they never told me it was gonna be shipped out earlier you know but there's people on XDA you know we've been, there's forums that I follow and there's people that have been with Timo for 10 15 years and they have not gotten shipping yet and they're really pissed what I think T-Mobile did is they just closed, they put a blindfold on and got some order numbers and shipped them out. And those people that were complaining and asking about the phones that been with them showed them that they really wanted this phone and they were really, really disappointed that at and was the last carrier to announce that they were going to have the phone and literally the first ones to ship it out. So it made me mad for a bit but once they told me my phone was going to be shipped out and I saw my credit card being charged yesterday morning I was a really really happy camper so but either way people who order it people who haven't received it yet I'm pretty sure they're going to get it they're going to get it soon there's no need to wait there's no need to get mad he's going to have to wait a little longer even if it means Sorry guys. Sometimes it is what it is. I mean, unless you could pass your order and go uh, pick it up at the store, but you know how Timo rolls. You can't pass your order until you refuse shipping. So, uh, yeah guys, I'll keep you guys updated. About to go on Target and uh, buy my Starbucks and stuff and things I need. And I'll keep you guys posted on when I get my phone. Alright, thanks for watching.